we got this guy here too. Um, should we try and axe him? Since he's kind of derped out a little bit. He's been axed. Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I'm an old guy gaming, and looks like Bravo is probably attacking us here. Oh, man, that's just terrible. Um, so, yeah, we've, uh... I'm not as far along as I would have liked to have been uh, before I started the next episode, uh, because basically what happened was I went out looting... And I was way across the map. And we we had a triple attack. And they just... They didn't... I don't think they destroyed any pieces completely, but they did so much damage that it sent me way back in nails uh, for repair and boards and everything else. Um, so I went out and, you know, did some, some more looting. But I still don't... You know, I, I usually like to have a full stack of nails before we start next building. Uh, the next building, but... We have 268, which is still quite a bit, and we have 96 planks, so I think we're going to go ahead and just use that and, you know, do the best we can with what we have to work with. So, that is the deal there. Uh, let's put a couple things up, So, and we're going to do an upgrade or two in this episode as well. Um, let's, uh, let's actually look at this. So, I planted a third crop plot up there and got a light going on it because I'm having a hard time you know, keeping my animals um, fed. Uh, there was one point where their health was, was down quite a ways. And um, so I, I ended up planting a third crop plot. And, oh, look. And I can't keep up with them fertilizer-wise. So I think what we'll do here is we're going to go ahead and install the fertilizer upgrade, or the feces tray upgrade here, to give us, you know, a little extra fertilizer to use. I also have upgrades that I want to install on on this guy. We haven't put any upgrades on here, in fact. Uh, so increased power efficiency would be good to put on there. And then, oh, oh, that's the yeah, that's the other Bravo guy that's caught behind the fence. Okay, so we don't have to worry about him. Um, Alpha and Charlie are probably going to. Oh, look! Speak of the devil. It looks like. They're coming over. Or, uh, what are they doing? Yeah, they're coming over now. Okay, so let's deal with these guys. I'm pretty sure that's Alpha based upon where they're coming from. And then we very likely will get a visit from Charlie today too. Uh, so anyway, yeah, we're going to do the feces upgrade for the animal pen, and then, then our animal pen will be fully upgraded. And we're going to continue working on some building stuff here and fend off the enemies and, yeah. That's kind of the plan for today's episode. All right, so let's let these guys get a little bit closer. I need to repair my equipment too. It's getting it's getting down. All right. Okay, he's down. And he's down. All right. How do you like those beans, Alpha? <laughs> Let's uh, grab their stuff here. And like I said, uh, definitely expecting an attack from Charlie at some point today, sooner or later. So we just need to keep an eye on them. And then once, once they attack, then we should have another day or two of grace, grace period, you know, that we can go out and keep doing stuff. So I'm, you know, it's it's not a guarantee that we get two day, two days off or a break for two days, but that seems to be kind of the pattern that's happening 
Um, and, you know, it's nice because then I can sort of kind of plan around that. Let's grab that. And since we're running around, let's just see if there are any other spawns on the island before we proceed. Okay, I'm not seeing anything over there. I have been looting, you know, plates here and there, so I've, I'm continuing to upgrade the wall because <clears throat> the hunters do sometimes come around here and attack on this side. So we'll probably armor plate maybe to here, and then starting down there, we'll probably just keep it wood unless it becomes evident later on that they are also attacking uh, on those sides. Okay, so let's see. How are you guys doing? Eh, not too bad. Okay, so well, let's see. We need an ingot, a plate, scrap, and adhesive. Let's grab that stuff. There's the plate. I have one left. I think we needed two scraps and two adhesives, right? Something like that. Let's put all this stuff back in here. Uh, we can put the weapons parts in here because I have two full stacks of those, so I'm feeding the rest of them into the... Uh, Recycler thing. That can go in there. This can go in here. That can go in there. That can go in there. And this can go in here. Let's put the hammer back. No, actually, let's keep the hammer because we're going to need it today. Okay, so we need to make one ingot. So we'll grab the iron and the copper. And we'll throw that in there. I don't have any lockpicks on me at the moment. Let's take a peek and see if Charlie's on their way. So far, nope. Okay. Now, while I'm thinking about it, let's get stuff re... Well, no, let's get the upgrade done first. So I don't accidentally use something that I had intended to use. There we go. Feces tray installed. Okay, so, so with three chickens, we should get a decent amount of uh, manure there to help us with our fertilizer keep our fertilizer going the other thing I could do of course is put in a second wood stove which I probably will um you know and then that there's that stupid eagle that'll help uh, with producing more ash for fertilizer too but yeah as you can see I've got three crop plots going up here these two are nothing but tomatoes this is everything else and um, I haven't done any upgrades any or I haven't done the efficiency upgrade so I want to do that on all of these guys too in fact we have the we can do this material wise. Let's let's um let's make three more ingots. I'm eventually gonna have four crop plots. That's what we had in season four, and it seemed to work out really well. But uh, for now, let's just do uh, these guys. Now I wanna I wanna repair stuff, so let's just grab a stack of those. Some of these, some of these, some of this, some of that. And I think that's all we need for repairing stuff. Let's get all this stuff repaired. This rifle especially needs some attention. We can't repair the pick. God only knows why. Well, God in cold games. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but for whatever reason, cold games wants us to make picks and not repair them. I don't understand that. I really don't. But it is the way the game works, so we got to deal. We got a deal. Okay, so we got the stuff repaired. Um, let's go back up here again for a moment. I'm not going to bother upgrading these unless we do it way, way late in the game when I just have gobs and gobs of resources <laughs> like that actually happens in this game. Um, because I've been told that you're better off just building another one rather than upgrading. Uh, it's cheaper to build another one rather than upgrading the existing ones based upon you know the materials and stuff that you use. I haven't actually done the math on that to verify if that's true, but, um, yeah. Okay, so we're going to need six sinew and 12 electronics. We already got the scrap in our inventory. So let's grab uh, our sinew, and we'll just grab some electronics. Nobody's coming yet. Okay. So let's see. Guess we... It doesn't matter which one we upgrade. They're all going to benefit benefit equally. Oh, we got to get the ingots. Got to get the ingots. We're also going to make a couple of changes in this corner of the base to today. Yeah, let's grab the ingots. Okay. Nobody coming. 
All right, so we'll upgrade this one first. And then we're going to, yeah, we're going to have to wait for mass and power uh, to build back up to do the other two. But I have the materials uh, for them. So if we don't get to the other two in this episode, I'll probably just do the, that off camera as the power and mass comes back. So for now, let's just put this stuff back in here. Um, yeah, electronics can go back in here. Scrap can go back in there. Now, let's grab our nails and our planks and our cordage. Right, yeah, okay. That's that's right, okay. Now, um, the, what I want to do down here is... I want to make a couple of changes. We don't actually need these foundations here. Um, so what we're going to do, and is, and, and I want to grab this whole wall, or full wall, and put it somewhere else and put, put half walls in here. Okay, so let's just get it out of the way for the moment. Find a place for it to attach. Can we bring it down? Yeah, like that. Okay, now uh, we're going to make a half wall here. Half wall, ha half wall. Wherefore art thou? Why aren't my There we go. Why isn't my eyes seeing those? And we'll pop that, pop that in place of the the big wall because the hunter's AI they can't dive down underneath and swim underneath that. They're not that smart. Okay. Now we just want to pop. What if we? We come up under like this. There we go. Okay, cool. Now, let's make another half wall. Always keeping an eye open for the enemy. And we're going to put another half wall here. And then once those are in place, we should be able to remove those two foundations. And the walls should theoretically stay there. Now, I've never actually noticed the hunters come, try and come through this way. But let's just assume that they can. Um, it might not be a bad idea actually to block that either, but yeah, for now. Okay. Now we should be able to remove this and that wall should stay put. Well, you know what though? If we do decide to put, oh, you know what we could do with this one actually? Let's grab this. Under here, under here, there we go. And let's actually put this one up here, like that. We may do that in these spots here for more for aesthetic reasons than for necessity. And you know what? Since we're doing it, we might as well put another half wall in this spot too. That way, it's completely blocked. There's no way the hunters could ever get through there. Whether or not their AI ever would try, I don't know. But we're not taking chances. Oh, that's that's attached the wrong direction, isn't it? Weird. Okay, here. Let, let's uh, yeah, let's redo this. So let's flip it around this way. No, it went... What? Okay, what are you doing? You're killing me. You're killing me, Smalls. Okay, let's try it again without flipping it this time. There we go. That's what we wanted to do. That's what we wanted to do. Okay, now... Let's put this guy right in there. Look at that! It was as if it was meant to be. Fantastic. Okay. Okay. Now, we ourselves can still get through here because we can just swim right, well, swim right underneath here. <laughs> Plus, you know, once we move these foundations out of the way, it'll be even easier for us to get through. Okay, still clear? Yes. Now, we're going to take these foundations and we're going to put them over on the other side. 
So let's just set it down right about here-ish, because it's probably not going to let me carry it all the way over there. pop this in here but I think we're gonna have to f are we gonna have to flip this nope it lines up perfectly okay good very good let's grab that look again all clear okay now let's grab this piece and same thing we'll plop it down right here and then pick it up again. And put it... Guess what I just did, guys? I hit the delete key. I've been I've been really, really good about not doing that. But, except for that time. <laughs> Crap! Oh, man. All right. It happens. Yep. Got in a hurry. Wasn't paying attention. Okay, well... Let's, here, let me go back over here for a second before, yeah, that looks good. I like that. I like that. Looks good. Looks effective. I mean, you know what? We might even, again, for aesthetics more than necessity, we can't block that corner in, but maybe block these, at least these two in. The... The only reason I wouldn't, though, is the hunters do sometimes get caught underneath here, and then I pretty much have a free kill. So, yeah, let's... I'm not going to do that right now. If if ever. I'll think about it. We'll give it some thought. Well, that sucks that I killed off that foundation, but that's okay. It happens. All right, so what we're going to do now is... Eventually, we're going to, you know, make this like a, a big patio out here, and we're going to move the crop plots out here. Um, so I want to, I want to actually try something here. Let's, we need to get those walls finished too. But let's grab this foundation with end, the end key. Thank you. Okay, and we're going to plop that in there. And yeah, we're, we're probably going to take it all the way to here, but I I think the, the rock's going to clip through a little bit. But that might be okay. That might not be a big deal. Let's go look over here again. I know, these guys have me paranoid. <laughs> I just, it, it, The only thing about it is I'm not worried about them coming. I'm not worried about killing them. I'm worried about them doing a bunch of damage so my they take my nails and set me back on our building goals here. That's the biggest concern about them attacking. Okay, so let's see. I, th I think wisdom dictates that we should finish our walls before we mess with the patio. The patio is not, is, has nothing to do with our defenses. It's just our build. So let's keep working on our defenses and get those set. Okay. So um, let's see. We're going to want a window here. And then we're going to want a wall, a window and a wall, and two walls. One going down here. And then on this side, we have another window and another wall. Okay. We got that. Come on, wall. It's a bit toasty out. What is it? It's still August, yeah. It's it's mid to late August by now though. So autumn is just right around the corner. And that means we'll have a chance of being able to pick cotton in the wild, though it's pretty rare. You definitely can't count count on it for all the cotton you need, but it's always nice to get a little extra. Um, oh, you know what? We don't have a foundation down there, do we? Okay. Well, then let's put you here. 
And I'm gonna temporarily pick you up with end. And we're gonna put you over here if we can get get that to work. No, nope, gotta be further. No, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Now we put the wall here. And then we pick the foundation back up with end, not delete. You know, I think that delete that I just did may have been the very first one I did have done in season two, which isn't bad, all things considered. Maybe. If I had done it another time, I don't remember. Very cool. Okay. Next, we need um, a window corner piece to go there. We're still actually not doing bad on nails. In fact, we're going to probably run out of boards before we run out of nails. And then... Then we're going to have a solid wall and another window. So solid wall. I'm just matching the other side essentially here. Okay. Let's flip this this way and pop her in place. Okay. So solid wall, window, doorway. I'm just trying to think, do we need a doorway right there? We're going to need a doorway, some kind of door situation here. We might have to put like a right angle and then, you know, put the door there because we can't do a door with a corner piece. Didn't even think about that. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Put that there. <laughs> okay, put that there. <laughs> I'm laughing at my Discord. My dear friend Maruski just made a joke in the Discord. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't think we need a door here. I mean, what... If we're out here doing stuff, you know, we just we can just run to this door. It's a little extra running around, I suppose, but I'll tell you what. Let's not put a door in now, and if I change my mind later, I change my mind later. That's all there is to it. So we're just going to put a solid wall in there and then another window. And, yeah, we're going to have to figure out this situation. So the easiest solution is just to put a square wall here and a square wall here and then put the door in, you know, like maybe on this side. Um, we also, though, have this entrance, though, too, that... Well, we can put a straight-up door there, though, which we will, uh, just like we've done on the other side. Hmm. Okay, well, let's finish out the easy part first, the part where I don't have to think so hard, and then, then we'll figure out what we're going to do there. All right, so we got that done. We got that done. Wait, is that lined up right? I think I did something wrong here. Did I? Window, door, window. Window, door, window. No? Yes. I did screw it up. There's two there's two walls there. Oh, okay. That's easily fixed. Cuz it wasn't quite looking right to me. Here, we we haven't checked to see if our enemies coming in yet. Let's look. Take a quick peek see. Nope. All right. They're going to wait and attack at the most inconvenient time. Yeah, we just need to move uh, these over one. Press end. Okay. Pressing end. Not delete. Pressing end. You 
You know, another thing that I could look into doing is moving the end uh, or remapping the, the delete key so it's not right next to the end key. That could maybe help with that situation too. All right, now for here, what do we got going on? I think we just have two solid walls. Uh, yeah, we have two solid walls right before the corner. So we'll do the same thing here. So let's make two walls. We're still... Yeah, the planks are definitely going to run out before the nails, which is fine. Because the planks are a lot easier to make than nails are. And then, then we got to figure this situation out. We know for sure we're going to put a door in there, so let's just make the door right now. Get that done. Wall there. Yeah, I'm liking how this is coming together. I'm liking it. And a wall there. So we'll do the door. Um, see now, I, I obviously right. I can I can do a, a ninety degree corner here, and that's probably what we're gonna have to do. But you know, then it then we lose this area of the deck, and it kind of screws up the aesthetics of it. Just trying to think what we might be able to do about that. All right, you go there and you go there. We'll have to put some temporary foundations underneath here to get the other walls in. What if we... What if we did something like this? I'm just sort of kind of thinking out loud here. Let's take, um, oh, malnourished. That's not good. There's going to be a door on this side of the base too. I just haven't gotten that far yet, in case you guys are wondering. Um, you know what we're going to do, actually? Let's just have one steak. Uh, let's make ourselves some honey glazed ham. What do you guys think? We got some honey there, and what else do we need for that? We need potatoes and carrots. So four carrots, four potatoes. Four potatoes. All right, that's going to be the good stuff, man. That is going to be the good stuff. And that's going to, that should pop us into the next cap, uh, level cap. You know, give us a, a health cap of 96 and a stamina. Maybe even two, put us two forward. Yeah, I don't know what up to, uh, what's up with Charlie today. I guess they're just not interested in attacking us. Not that I'm complaining about that, mind you. How much wood do I have? Let's take half of this wood and make some more planks. Well, actually, before we do that, let's make the other pieces that I want to make. So I'm going to make another um, half ceiling here. And we might need a foundation, too. Oh, you need to be stoked. You have any fat in there? No, you don't. Okay. I'm just thinking here for a second. Okay, that's about half done. Let's get uh, this guy out, and we can turn... Add on, not that that's going to help us a whole lot out here, but we have this light. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. What if we were to grab this guy and turn him like so, put it there, and maybe make a quarter ceiling? You see what I'm going to do here? You guys get in the picture? Um, see, it'd be, I'd, I would have gone this way with it, except for that I can't attach it to the this angle. 
So it's just going to be easier to go this way with it. I mean, I could if I placed another foundation down and kind of tricked it like we did before, but... Um, okay, so we need you to come back uh, like that. There we go. Look at that. Okay, so that means now that this needs to turn into a door. Oh, do we have... Yep, yeah, we're getting attacked. Okay. I just happened to look over there and see the blue light. I can't forget about my ham. In fact, you know what? We should be able to go grab it, the first one out before they get here. Let's eat it now. Look at that. Max health increase. Okay, cool. So we are now at 96 max health and stamina. Okay, let's let these guys get on over here. And we'll be ready to greet them. Sorry about the darkness. I see two incoming. Okay, he's dead. He's going around the other side. Where is he? I can't... Oh, he's right there. Okay. I couldn't see him. Whew. Wow, we took a beating there, didn't we? How's our armor? Oh, our armor's good. Wasted a bunch of ammo, too, but I couldn't see him, man. <laughs> I totally couldn't see where he was. Okay, so unless they have a straggler, I think that concludes our attacks from the hunters for the, hopefully the next two days. So let's loot these guys. We are going to have to make some more uh, rifle ammo. We only got one, one piece back there. Okay. Good. Oh, wait. I thought I saw another light out there. Okay. You're at 73%. Uh, yeah, so that shot us up to 96 uh, health cap. It's a beautiful thing, guys. It's a beautiful thing. Uh, they gave us an egg, too. Let's throw that in there. All right. I want to finish the things up over here. How are you guys doing on water? Oh, wow, you're low. Okay. Uh, look at... Wow, 65 feces already? Oh, man. That was fast. Okay, let's grab that. Uh, these guys need some food, too. We can give them this grub. That's going to give them, like, 1% food, though. I completely disagree with that. Chickens love grubs. I think grubs should give them way more food than that. Just, you know... Whoa! Okay. Someone else is coming. Where are you, Yahoo's at? Is it just you? Nope. We got this guy here, too. Um, should we try and axe him? Since he's kind of derped out a little bit. He's been axed. That was probably an another Bravo attack. Um... I'm almost positive it was. Unless Charlie had two more guys that were lagging way behind. I don't know. Okay. Now, where were we? Uh, first thing we're going to do is grab this, and we're going to make ourselves ten of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, so we have five in the gun and then, you know, five additional. And let's grab this for fertilizer and that for fertilizer. And make some more fertilizer out of that. We're going to have to put the copper in here. Put that in there. Let's grab the ham and or honey glazed ham and put that in the fridge for now. And we'll eat that later. Uh, so we got to feed the, the birds. Uh, our tomatoes are not quite done. So we're going to give them the last tomato. We're going to give them two potatoes. Let's give them six onions and three blueberries. 
and yeah. You can see um, that their health starts to go down when they run out of food. See that bird's at 93 out of 100. Um, but they, man, they are cranking out the fertilizer. That is great. Okay, so let's give them all of this. And that gets them up to 73% food, which isn't too bad. Let's refill their water. Once we get the tomatoes in, you know, full production, then this will be a little easier. Are you kidding me? Oh, for goodness sakes. We just don't want to stop. You getting yourself stuck, buddy? Yes, you are. All right, I got a little something, something for you. Here you go. How you like that? Hey, we got some rifle rounds back. Okay. I'm not sure who that would have been. <laughs> uh, but fortunately, they only sent one, so. Okay, back to this. Uh, water. Oh, yeah, we we're going to give the... We we're going to top the bird's water off, so let's do that. Okay, and then... Refill these. I'm going to have some repairing to do now, of course. Put those guys in there. Oh, all right, let's go finish this up, and then we need to wrap up this episode. We're running a little long this time, but that's all right. It's been a good episode. Okay, press end to take this back up, because we now have to, we now have to put a door here. This will go down here, but I can't put it there right now until we get a foundation place. So for now, I'm just going to temporarily set it there. So we need a door and a corner piece. Uh, so door, corner piece, and then an actual, well, doorway, and then an actual door itself. Look at that. We're shy of one, one plank. Can you believe that? One plank. What? Okay, well, we'll just have to make an extra, extra point to finish that up, too. Let's get this reloaded. Okay, the birds should be in pretty good shape. For the moment. I might... Uh, I mentioned this last time, too. I might put some rails on here later when we can afford to do it. They're just really expensive. Just for aesthetics. Okay, so door goes there. Corner piece will go here. And there we go. It works. It actually works. What do you know? What do you know? Okay, are we making a... No, we couldn't make the door because we needed one more plank, right? Yeah. So now we'll make the door. So what's... Uh, what has to happen to finish up our defenses is I'm going to temporarily put uh, some foundations down in here so that we can wall this side up just like we did on the other side. And, you know, for now I'm doing it for more for aesthetics just so the building, you know, matches on both sides. But later on in the future particularly after we, you know, destroy Charlie's base, which we will do at some point. That's not going to happen right away. They could, you know, re-pop over on that side, and then, you know, we'll start getting attacks on this side. So we might as well just build it right now uh, as if that, that could happen. So it's done. All right, so let's put this in place here. Like so. And ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this episode. So yeah, what I'm going to do is the usual loot off camera for a couple of days. Uh, we should have, like I said, a couple of days of grace now, hopefully, uh, from the attacks. Um, the next building uh, thing without will be to put those two foundations in there, get the rest of the front of the base walled. Now, I am going to I am gonna extend this out too, so probably like put like a, maybe a curved um, deck out there, uh, or even ex 
extend the the actual base itself out further but we're also i'm going to build up too um eventually so that's kind of what's coming up in, in terms of building so that is it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed the episode and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment and share the video and we will catch you in the next one goodbye